All right, hello YouTube. This is going to be a video on how I set up my Ascend FS12T, a fishing kayak for scuba diving. Um, I've had some requests for it when the people see me diving out of it in my videos, and so this will take care of that. This is how it looks when I do a normal dive um, without my DPV or um, any extra stuff with it. Gear up, I'm just going to gear up on the shore and then jump in the river over here and then move on downstream. Let's start from the top. Um, anchor rope and anchor normally reside right here. I'll toss the anchor up. So if I'm going to use an anchor, I'll usually leave it up here where I can grab it with my hand. Uh, but I always secure everything off somehow to the boat. Um, like I said, anchor rope here is right now. I just gonna what I do here is I just attach the loose end or the live end to the uh, to the boat, and I take this part down with me and let out line as I need to keep it at the right uh, length for the depth I'm at. All right, and then uh, my fins I just tuck underneath the bungees that are provided in the front here. It keeps them in, keeps them in place. Uh, and again, everything everything at one point or another is is bungeed off at some somehow to. Uh, keep it with the boat if it flips, um, which I've done once. <laughs> um, it was just a windy time, and I'll, tell, I'll explain that later. Um, my hood, mask, uh, gloves, etc., I keep right there. It's again attached to the bungee that I installed to actually wrap to, to secure the paddle when I'm in the water. That's uh, just again bungee right where I can grab it between my legs like that so it's close by. Um, I like the Ascend seat system here. I like the Ascend seat system and it's uh, raised up off the bottom, keeps your rear end out of the water, um, which is really important if you're in the boat for quite some time. Um, it's not only with the uh, Ascend, but it's also on other models as well, uh, especially in the fishing kayak realm. Um, this is just a PVC portion that I made to hold my dive flag. Um, I use it as a floating marker buoy when I'm in the water. And it just looks like that. Um, it just keeps it up, gives me some visibility um, for what if I pop up away from the boat for some reason. I can see it in the distance and it also gives other kayakers, boaters, and boarders a uh, clear view of it as well. That doesn't stop people from assuming that this is a drift when I am towing it in the river. Even though it says diver below stay clear, they still think it's a drift. Um, and I've actually had people try to take it under tow while I'm towing it. Um, but uh, yeah, enough said about that. And on the back, um, fits very neatly is my BC and my uh, tank and, and my uh, goodie bag attached to it. And I just usually secure that through the loop in the rear handle. I'll use a, a clip of some sort, like this one on my dive light, and I'll just run it through and secure it. Again, this is just to keep it with the boat should I uh, flip it or lose it somehow. Um, not much else to say about that really that I can think of. Um, I have not taken this into the ocean yet, um, but I have taken it into large lakes. I had it in Lake Tahoe, which is where I flipped it, uh, trying to get in it. Um, one time it was just, it was just, it was a very windy day and the, some, a boat wake hit me at the same moment as I was scooting in and it allowed some water to come over the gunnel just at a little bit of weight and then my bc which is already in it flipped <laughs> and uh went to the bottom um because i hadn't secured it yet dummy and uh <clears throat> lost a few other things out of it but i did recover everything had to do a free dive down to grab my bc uh put it on down below and then went around collecting the rest of my stuff including my mask which i had lost down there as well um, so now I do things in a much better order. That was actually probably the only time I've ever thrown stuff in and did not secure it before I tried to jump in. Um, it was stupid of me. So that's that. Um, if I do take my DPV, 
which is there, what I will do, well, let me show you. So if I do take my DPV, I just stick it right there and I straddle it with my legs. Um, I will secure it as well. I will clip off the leash rope to one of the bungees. And again, just to keep it with the boat. Um, so I don't have to go swimming for stuff or lose it somewhere. All right, so that's it. Um, I'm so again, this is the Ascend FS12T fishing kayak from Bass Pro Shops. Uh, not using it as a fish, fishing boat, but as a dive boat. Hope that helps. Any questions, please leave them in the comments and I can do a follow-up video. Um, actually, I will do a follow-up video on actually diving from it and show some footage for that. All right, take care.